Dutch peasant in Kelra, right on top of where I have an army. Wow, lots of people are building very suspicious institutions of personal liberty. Um, so who's this? This is New Limburg. Who I believe is down here. Twenty-four. Don't think I'm going to find cheaper than this. Let's just do that. There we go. Developments resolved. Rebels have been crushed. Army is being crushed. Locked in. They did arrive. They're really rocking out the uh, the people. Okay, so this army is now stuck on this side of the island. So let's go hunt them down, kill them. We're actually winning this fight. Wow. Oh, it's because their ships have been sinking. Aha, excellent. And our ships sink, they lose morale. We sank 12 heavy, 16 lights. We captured 6. Probably transports, yeah, mostly. And they have another fleet coming in. Oh, this is, uh, this is the heavies. That's a fight I'd really rather not fight. Because my own heavies have taken a bit of a bludgeoning. We're going to try and make a run for it, but I honestly don't think we will. Stack wipe. Are they all stack wiped? I think they are. Right, so now if we grab your infantry... No, can't do that here. Never mind. Right, let's just take this territory. In fact, that's their entire army gone. They're down to 5,000 men. Excellent. So, all Malika has left is their fleet. Would be nice if Paradox fixed naval combat. Currently, the loss of morale is way too devastating. I disagree with that. There are ways around it. Namely, the entirely undervalued naval ideas. It's one of these. There we go. Morale hit when losing a ship, minus 33%. If you have naval ideas, then you don't suffer as badly. It's a big reason to take them. I don't have maritime. Oh, no bloody wonder I don't have enough sailors. Also, how the hell do I have a naval force limit of uh, 723 without either maritime nor naval? I don't even have the plus 50% naval force limit modifier. Flipping hell, I can have a lot of ships. Yeah, you really need to back off. This is not a fight we'll win. And yes, rhetorical question. I know exactly how I've achieved it. <laughs> I'm just surprised because I thought I at least had maritime. And I haven't even been building that many shipyards. Look how many of them still have available. And this is not the sus subjects. Okay, infantry, disband. Infantry, disband. Infantry, disband. So now I suddenly have an infantry pool again. I'm going to go to conform to template and standard mark. Why can't I do this? Build mercenaries here.
At least I thought I could. No, I don't want offensive ideas. I really want the other military ideas. Your transport fleet is fighting again. And my combat fleet is almost fully repaired. Off you go. Right, now. Oh, you're only going to let me do it in provinces that I actually own. That's irritating. Once again, we're crushing their fleet because of the morale thing. 13 transports, 17 lights, and we captured 10. Um, let's go back into port and repair some more. Oh, now I'm gaining sailors again. Use of sailors, 530. What? What? They're heavy fleets fighting up there. Um, I'm going to wait until we're repaired. Yeah, because you're just annihilating that unit. So I need another five of these, and then we're done. Well, 15. Burkers are pissed off again. What a surprise. You're fighting Ming's fleet again. Those are the heavies, those are the heavies. Alright, let's see what we can do. We outnumber them three to one. And Ming's troops are now pouring across. Yeah, Ming's transport fleet has arrived to bolster our numbers. This is going to be a real wrecker of a fight. Oh, just one. New Helderland once again. What a surprise. Sort by cost. Look for green. That's a different green. Actually, it may not have been. No, because New Helderland got territory in Colombia, didn't they? So that probably is actually Helderland. Gone. They're happy again. Three hundred ships turned up. <laughs> oh, whoa! -ho! Okay, so apparently all of the colonial nations decided to show up as well. Crikey, we sank twenty-four heavies. That was a good result. Well done. They've come a long bloody way. Yeah, Ming's the rival, but we're allied. Well, not allied, we're just in the same war. We're in a, both of us are in a war against Malacca. I didn't actually know what Ming's fighting Malacca for. It's literally just against Malacca, so they may just be trying to get more col colonial stuff. Oh, no fleets here. Let's sally out and kill them. Is that their heavies? That's all of their heavies. Meanwhile, the rest of their fleet's trapped here where the colonials are fighting them. Can't say I disprove. That 
Sounds like a whole lot of your problem. Advisor. Actually, no. Global Tariffs is a Dutchman, so we can promote him. Sank 24 heavies. We captured one. This is more like it. Poor old Malika, you were doing so well, and then I happened. Yeah, we are well and truly gaining in sailors now. Good. Good. Stock exchanges. Counting houses. That's a lot more buildings done. Colonial stuff happening. Good. All right, so Malika, I would need to take some more of your stuff for this piece to happen. Lose 3,400 ducats. Some members of the parliament are having concerns regarding our increasingly bad reputation. They're claiming that it's having a negative effect on our trade relations. This question has been raised numerous times, but in the past, but so far it's been little been so far it's been thought of little consequence. This time the matter is coming to some really heated debates, though. Perhaps we should try to settle things before they get out of hand. Is that a delayed reaction to the dry docks? It might be. Except the sailors required was at 700 plus for a while. I've seen it fluctuate weirdly like that in the past. I don't really know why. Okay, so Ming pieced out. Took some territories there. Um, that's fine. That still gives me a lot of potential land of my own. Now, where is... Up there. That's territory I definitely 100% want. That. And I will actually give up on some of this stuff. I'll take this. too much. That's not. Okay, so I need to transport my army over that side. Okay. There's no way Ming would give me access seeing as we're at war with each other. Where's my other transport? Oh, you're over there. How'd you get over there? Right, well, let's go pick him up. Thankfully, we don't have very far to go. In fact, solid. Let's go all the way up here. That's a lot of Ming troops. I have a feeling that this is where the battlefields versus Ming would be, if and when I decide to do that. Maybe winning some battles at sea helped. I don't know. Oh, no, it's gone up again. 729 a month. 
I have no idea. Oh. It's because my heavy ships were at sea. That's probably what it was. When they're docked. 729. Five fifty five. So yeah, it's because my heavy ships are at sea, and I had a lot more of them. Tuscany's out here as well. Tuscany have had a surprisingly good game. Size, isn't it? Yeah, so I need to take that fort down there in order for this to really piece out. Well, at least I'm regaining my manpower pretty quickly, seeing as I'm not using any infantry anymore. You guys could go back to drilling. Must do something. Namely, take out a loan. Oh no. Right, let's go and take those. You can push up. And then we're holding both of the uh, the border provinces here. And then we can start doing the parallel. Moving up the, uh, the lines. And we just need to take the uh, fort. So I'm going to grab the... I was going to say I'm going to grab the war fleet again. But I might just grab you lot and then do this. Because I have a feeling we've humbled their... military sufficiently at this point. So they keep on... Oh, is that me pushing them out? Might be. Well, the minions are doing a good enough job. It's a fight you should definitely be able to win. Especially as you're throwing more and more ships into that fray. Yep. They lost 14 transports. Another fight going on there. Take out a loan when you're this rich. It's not so much about being rich, it's just not having them, the change on me. I mean, you, you expect me to carry a wallet when I'm this wealthy? Everyone knows I'm this wealthy. <laughs> Just accept a letter of credit and then I'll pay you back tomorrow. When I actually can get my people to talk to your people. That's how it works, isn't it? Ah, they're seeding this stuff back again. Bah humbug! Come on, take the fort. Am I getting maximum bonus? I'm not. Let's send in some more. And Paintail is currently the leader there. So let's move Paintail over to here so we get the leader bonus as well. Getting that. Malika wants a peace offer, eh? Why I live, please speak in English. Oh, that works too. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Dana. I 
That did look suspiciously like a bot. I'm losing innovativeness. That's unacceptable. Let's check up on all the things. Uh, no infantry? No. Artillery. Yes. Colony is self sustaining. Uh, let's go here then. Right, now you'll accept. Unfortunately for you, I will also be requiring some financial incentive. That'll do. Marvellous. So, let's start the coring process, although I've just realised I just teched up. This is going to be extremely expensive. But we've begun. It seems to have a bit of an overflow in the financial area. Yes, yes, we are making quite a lot of money. It's glorious. And two of my minions are seeking independence, which is unacceptable. Oh, New Zealanders. That's a first. The new over ISIL, which is one of these guys. Canada. I've just been feeding you stuff, Canada. You are now chill. That's better. Right, well, I think that this is a pretty good spot to end this stream as well. So thank you everyone for watching. I do hope you're enjoying this. If you are, be sure to hit that follow button so you get notifications when I'm live again in the future. If you're really enjoying this, then do consider subscribing. It helps the channel out and lets me do more of this kind of content. If you want to support this channel, then uh, check out my Patreon, which you can find at patreon.com slash mordredviking. I do also have a YouTube, which you can find at this link here. If you've missed the beginning of this series, you can find and catch up with events there. If you want to hang out with me and the rest of the community, hang, uh, head on over to our Discord, which you can find at this link, and it'll be great to see you, because it's always nice to see new people there. Uh, I will be back again in about an hour. I don't know if that will start immediately. <laughs> My throat is actually killing me right now. Um, but I will stream more. I just need to take some strepsils and lemzips and other things, so that it stops doing that. I will then be streaming more with Japan. So the... <laughs> Kind of strangely that the war with China is very much heating up. We have taken some of their territories, including Beijing. Um, they are in the process, I think, of ming exploding, But they haven't really started doing it yet. So back in an hour-ish, once I've had something to eat, once I've uh, fixed the throat. And yeah, it should be good. So thanks everyone for watching, and I'll catch you guys in an hour.